A Mars orbiter is on a mission led by the United Arab Emirates after launching successfully Monday. Holly Williams reports on what the mission hopes to achieve and what it means for the Arab world. It's the first of three missions to Mars with launches planned for this summer. And this one is called HOPE. It lifted off on Monday morning, beginning a seven-month journey to the Red Planet. It's the Arab world's first ever interplanetary mission, an extraordinary achievement for the United Arab Emirates Space Agency, which was only set up in 2014. We spoke with Sarah Al Amri, the lead scientist. Uh, and this is a transformational uh, time for us. Our children today woke up to an entirely different Emirates, to an entirely different Arab region. The mission was launched from Japan and the spacecraft was built in the US in collaboration with American universities. But Al Amri, who's also a Minister of State for Advanced Sciences, told us the Mars probe is intended to kickstart her country's move away from an economy dependent on exporting oil and gas. You need to have an entire generation of scientists, engineers that are passionate for, for building things that are new, that for building an entire nation that's completely different than one that their parents grew up in. And that requires something that's inspirational. The mission will study dust storms and other weather systems on Mars. It'll join six other spacecraft already orbiting the planet, three of them American. Holly Williams, CBS News.